Published time, the 25th of October 2018-1104 Edited time, the 25th of October 2018-1145 American equities face another major sell-off on Wednesday. It was one of the worst trading sessions for U.S. stocks in years, erasing all gains seen in 2018. Analysts name President Donald Trump's trade wars as one of the reasons. The Dow Jones Industrial Average fell 608 points, or 2.4%, to 24,583.42. Meanwhile, the Nasdaq Composite Index dipped 329.14 points, or 4.4%, to 7,108.4. Read more The Tech Heavy Index is more than 10% below its August 29th all-time high, entering the correction territory. Wednesday was the worst day for the Nasdaq since August 18, 2011. What is happening on Wall Street is hardly surprising. The U.S. is implementing a sharp monetary policy and is waging foreign trade wars against everyone. In such conditions it becomes harder and harder to grow. There is still room for correction in the U.S., so we are waiting for the development of the situation, Roman Blinov, head of analytical department at International Financial Center said in an email to RT. The analyst also noted corporate earnings disappointment in the U.S., a growing conflict over budget spending between Italy and the European Union, and growing crisis around oil power Saudi Arabia over the killing of journalist Jamal Khashoggi. The sell-off on Wall Street dragged down some global markets as well. The standout loser, Thursday, was Japan's Nikkei Index, which lost 3.72%. In China, Shanghai Composite traded slightly higher at 0.5%, while stock indices in Europe were either trading flat or showing modest gains. For more stories on economy, 